Hey guys, what's up? Pase Baller here. We are now on this second game, our second prediction for this January 6, 2022 NBA game day. Uh, this is the game between Detroit Pistons with a record of 7-29 and going up against Memphis Grizzlies having a record of 25-14. and um, This one will be played at 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time, so that's going to be 9 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. And before we proceed, I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed uh, to our YouTube account or YouTube channel uh, yet. Again, click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on the bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications um, whenever new videos are uploaded. All right, let's take a look at um, the standings for both teams. For Detroit Pistons, they are the number 14 of the Eastern Conference. For their last 10 games, they have only won 3 games. And approaching this game, they're coming off that blowout loss. Now for, <clears throat> for their opponent, Memphis Grizzlies, they are at number 4 in the Western Conference. For their last 10 games, they have won uh, 6 out of their last 10. Approaching this game, they're actually coming um, with, uh, I mean, they're actually approaching this game with a 4-game winning streak. All right, so sorry about this. What's going on with my phone, man? Right, Memphis Grizzlies, they are actually enjoying the home court advantage. Um, I'm just checking on something here if Memphis Grizzlies actually played last night. Yeah, Memphis Grizzlies also had the rest while Detroit Pistons played last night. Um, so it's like the first game, right? Um, and obviously, momentum, uh, Memphis Grizzlies got it, man. Six out of winners of six games out of their last 10, and uh, they're actually having a four game winning streak approaching this game. So, everything pointing towards Memphis Grizzlies. Memphis Grizzlies is obviously the better team as well. Uh, let's take a look at the injury list for Detroit Pistons. Uh, they still have a lot here Jeremy Grant, Olenek. Jackson, Livers, Smith, Stewart, and Corey Joseph. Okay, while for Memphis, where's Memphis? All right, here we go. Well, for Memphis, we have Conkar, Tillman, Brooks, Melton, and Anderson. Uh, they are actually um, confirmed out for this game. And we have Terry, Bain, and Pons actually on um, game time decision for this particular game. So four confirmed out, possibly seven depending on the um, condition of Terry, Bain, and Pons. Okay, I think we all know what's going to happen here. Memphis is going to win. I mean, that's, come on, man. If someone would say Detroit will win, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to collapse. Um, but the question here is, would Memphis Grizzlies be able to, uh, you know, cover the spread? And the spread, by the way, is actually minus 12.5. Uh, my pick on this one is that, yes, they would go, uh, go, go right there, win that game, and actually uh, blow this game down. Memphis Grizzlies, man, they're actually, uh, they're actually deadly, man. I'm looking at uh, Ja Morant. Uh, uh, I forgot um, they were up against whom... That game, uh, Cleveland Cavaliers, man. I look, I, I'm looking at Jamarant. It's like, he would, he, if he would go straight. Once he sets his feet in the paint, man, you just can't stop him. It's either you would actually give him two free throws, or actually he would go out there and, uh, you know, put the ball inside that hoop. So, uh, I, I it, it's mu much like you know, much like what happened with Detroit Pistons and Charlotte Hornets. Um, of course, I can't, you know, I can't imagine what you know what the final score would be but yes i think memphis grizzlies would actually have this burned out for detroit pistons M memphis grizzlies minus 12.5 sorry about that grizzlies minus 12.5 peace out pass i love god bless